Warmer temperatures mean construction season on Kansas roads. KDOT wants drivers to think of workers as you pass by. KS and Samantha Boring spoke with KDOT employees who help maintain those roads. She joins us now live with what they want you to do to keep yourself and them safe. Samantha. Julia, it's National Work Zone Awareness Week. KDOT says 13 people died in Kansas work zone crashes in 2022. Speeding and distracted driving are contributing factors. That's our office up there is on the roads. Orange cones and waving traffic flags. There to protect you and workers like Jared Kruger and Chris Briley. Both are KDOT employees helping to maintain the roads for almost four years. It's a scary feeling when you're out there. I've got grandkids that want to that want to play with me and I want to play with them and it's I'd, I'd, I'd much rather go home safely. Briley says he gets it. Road work can be an inconvenience for people in a rush. What we do is better to the roadway so that you can get from point A to point B. In some instances, workers can be inches from fast moving traffic. They try to be alert and hope drivers do the same. We're trying to, to do you a public service Yes, we get paid to do that service, but it almost need hazard pay for everybody's cell phones and not paying attention. There's not a text or a phone call out there that can't wait while you're going through a construction zone. Drivers who usually get ticketed in, speed, in speeding in work zones face double fines. Now, KDOT asks anyone driving in a work zone to slow down and avoid any distractions. Here for you in Wichita, Samantha Boring, KSN News 3.